Which you can count on continues now with an 80 year old woman recovering after police say she was robbed at gunpoint at Augusta Mall. Yeah, in broad daylight, News Channel 6's Dernisa Jefferson spoke to the victim today. Dernisa live outside the mall with details. Brad, the victim tells me that assault happened at 3 o'clock in the afternoon in the parking lot at the Augusta Mall, and she says that's something she never expected to happen in broad daylight. So it is really scary and unnerving. Some people are on edge after an 80 year old woman was robbed at gunpoint at the Augusta Mall. And it just seems like crime is on the rise. And I've been down to that mall once, and after reading the news break on the um, phone, I was like, I'm not going back there. <laughs> it's just dangerous. Investigators say the victim was in the upper level parking lot around 3 o'clock in the afternoon when a man pointed a gun at her and said he would shoot her. And then he took out a gun. He took out a gun and pointed it at me and said, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. Give me the purse. He stole her bag with her cell phone and wallet inside, and when she fought back, he hit her in the head with the gun. Even in broad daylight, where you would think that maybe someone would see something happening, that's not always the case. It's enough to make some people not want to shop at the mall. I'm disabled, and so I would not want to but I'd be a target. And so I'm like, I'm not going there. While investigators are still searching for the suspect, some people say there needs to be more security at the mall. The security cars need to speed up the uh, efforts of getting around checking each parking lot. I think there needs to be more that they can look into as far as you know, enhancing law enforcement or hiring more police officers uh, and patrolling. We spoke to an Augusta Mall representative who says there are security measures in place, including a canine that checks for guns inside the mall. However, since this incident took place in the parking lot, that's where some shoppers say they want to see more security. They need to be undercover security. They can't have their patrol car marking them because if I see the patrol car, I'm not going to commit the crime. Investigators are still searching for the suspect involved in this case. They say he left the mall in a silver or tan sedan with no license plate and the front two hubcaps missing. Reporting live in Augusta, Jernisa Jefferson, WJBF, News Channel 6.